So this is kind of uh, a part two, I guess, a successor to a previous Trash Days episode that we did where we went over to my anime list and we looked at the top ranking. We're going to do both, I think, maybe. Yeah, yeah we looked we'll at both. We looked at some that. top lists on my What do you think list. we did, Joey? You recorded the episode. I don't. <laughs> you <laughs> think <laughs> we did both? You think yeah. I remember? <laughs> I don't even remember what we did last episode and we filmed that 20 minutes ago. <laughs> but anyway, we're going to go onto my anime list uh, because even though the name is my anime list, they you can also rate a bunch of manga as well. And uh, users on my anime list have done that. We're going to be mm-hmm. looking at the top ranked uh, manga on my anime list and uh, give our thoughts on it. See if we agree. See if we disagree. Uh, yeah. Question: Do you guys still use my anime list? No, I know you no. don't. I mean, gone. Do you? No. Do you know anyone who does? Uh no. Not yeah. really. Okay. No. Just, I've just had a thought for a post. I'm like, who's keeping this alive? I mean, I'm <laughs> sure there's quite a few. Okay, people. but like in in terms of tracking what you have watched. It's the only thing that you use. It, 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 is, yeah. it is the only one. Well, there's, there's Cause no few, one's opening up an now, Excel sheet. Now I'm thinking like, damn, we must be biased towards older shows back when people used to be way more active. But actually, are people more active? No, actually that's not true because I, like, you know, know, every time a seasonal anime Excel comes out, it always shoots up to number that's one. That's true, yeah, that's true. Yeah. So it's still I, definitely like, active. To, to me, my anime list is not the most accurate, but a good guesstimate. Okay, good, good. Uh, yeah, you because, someone had a set. Because it, it, it doesn't- It's a vibe check. <laughs> yeah, it doesn't like, it doesn't take into account, let's mm. say the mega popular shonen shows because otherwise it's always just gonna be Jujutsu Kaisen and mm. uh, the way, piece and, way, yeah. way, way at the top. Yeah, But it's like a good kind of like gauge of the modern, not casual, but someone who's like deep enough right. into mm-hmm. the- uh, uh, and, and this is how they they make their weighted scores. Yeah, so we- I don't know why uh, we were watching this. I, don't, yeah. I can't, yeah. this, is, this is math. The number of users giving a score for <laughs> this an anime. Is, this is algebra class all the over. Minimum yeah. number of scores, okay. Yeah. So do you guys want to go by top ranking or most popular? Yes, because that's something we apparently let's, got wrong last time. Yeah. <laughs> let's do Let's do the top rated, which uses the stars, if I'm not mistaken. Yeah, the uh, top rated uses yeah. the stars. Okay. So these but, are- But apparently the way, is that, is that, is that formula for this? I, I believe so. Which, what's this? Where did you get this link from? Where did you get this from? Carl? This is no, just like just, a hyperlink. Don't be pulling out formulas like that. Yeah, it says, how, <laughs> how do we, we rank, rank shows? Oh, okay, okay, open it up. Yeah. Open it up. Well, that was that. Oh, okay. So that's that. basically the first the first part of the equation is, it seems like a standard thing. Yeah. The second part is where I'm confused. I'm surprised you can glean any information from this. Well, if you read it, Connor, if are you reading it or are you just looking I'm at words? It. No, I'm reading it. So if it says top upcoming and most popular rankings are ordered by the number of users who have added their entry, that entry to their list. Wait, then what's the weighted does that, does that score? Make- huh? Then what's the weighted score? What's that for me? The weighted score is the, the out of 10. Score, yeah, it's the out of 10 score. So there's a difference between rating a show at, from one to 10 and putting it in that user's oh. list of like favorites. Oh, so I see, wait, no, no. So the weighted score, does that, is that, because obviously the, oh man, is that, is that them <laughs> trying to accommodate shows that are less popular? Yes. Yeah, probably, right? like yeah. A formula to so, it so what, yeah. what, okay, what it means it. is like, you know, you know, if a show doesn't have a lot of viewers, <laughs> yeah, 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 then I, obviously I it's gonna be, yeah. it's gonna be very much more skewed. So it's kind of like trying to balance out the yeah, scores. Yeah, because there's right. a lot of yeah. M's in there for bumping up the minimum yeah. number of people who rate a show. Yeah. Okay, point being, Mudan, just, Fucking skip, do some penis music and skip over that. Uh, basically, <laughs> they try to make it fair for a show that's less popular. But I don't think any of these top ones are going to be not. No, we we, we not don't either. need to skip the part where Connor just can't read. You know? Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh, I'm sorry. Connor, I was, why I'm, why I'm, are you asking them to skip that? Well, no, because I was reading it. Add, I was add reading the penis I, music, but don't skip it. Hold on, hold on. No, that's bullshit. I was reading the first part, aka the equation, trying to make sense of it before I read the second part. Because <laughs> yeah, I think you asked like, oh, what is, what is the second part? I don't understand. I don't understand. My no, 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 no. Okay. not the second matter. part. I think, I think it's the second part of the formula. Okay, okay. That's because I was, I was reading the first part of the formula okay. and I understood what that was trying to do. The second part I was trying to make sense of. Okay. So fuck okay. you, Gunn. All right. <laughs> All right, anyway, we're going to be looking at as uh, right. the, the top, uh, starting with, I mean, is anyone surprised? Berserk. With an average score of nine point four. Here's the thing. Here's the thing about Mark. But you just like overrated. <laughs> <laughs> actually, not even top fifty. Actually, uh, I actually I, I, don't. I don't know if this is right. 
it's overhyped. There is one. There is one big difference bet- I've noticed between the manga community and the anime community. The anime community always fucking bicker about yeah. everything. Mm-hmm. And feel like you can that, never. Yeah. You can never get a consensus except for Full Metal Alchemist Brotherhood being number one constantly. It's like yeah. the, that yeah. that meme image of like all the people sitting around at the table really like politely, and then people yeah. fighting each other. That's yeah. what it feels like with yeah. the manga and anime crowd. Yeah, 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 yeah. It's like, but manga readers normally you talk to most manga readers mm. and uh, they're like Berserk number one. They're like, yeah. <laughs> I'm like, yeah, yeah. It's it's just like there, there is more of a consensus on what the top rated uh, manga are because you see these same five avatars in every fucking- I mean, God, you can just say manga readers have better taste. I'm not gonna say that. <laughs> <laughs> I, I, I am in absolutely general. not going to say in that. In general. <laughs> Uh, but yeah. Do you agree with that statement, Joey? What? Of course you do. You're a manga reader, of Joey. I do. Yes. I'm one of them. <laughs> <laughs> My problem with manga readers is that they act like they're better than everyone. All right. All right, Joey. Um, it's because we are. You know what so, I'm say. I guess it's kind of hard to argue anything I'm looking at the, I'm looking Because I think we're all like, yep, number one. I'm yep. looking at this top six and I'm like, yeah, checks out. Yep, checks, checks out. out. Because, say, I, okay, I am actually surprised that JoJo's I, know, I mean, it's my favorite JoJo part. Part seven uh-huh. is my favorite. I think it's uh-huh. the absolute peak Araki writing. Uh-huh. Uh, I'm kind of surprised that it's universally agreed to be like the second best manga of all time though. I would have thought that people would think it maybe it's a little too out there. No, but no, no, no. I'm, I, I'm, I'm very happy that people I think it. though with the popularity, especially that the anime like brought mm. on to mm-hmm. just like the JoJo series in general. Yeah. I think just that hype of like wanting to continue reading it. And also like, you know, JoJo fans just consistently hype up part seven. You know, it's they're the like, best fucking yeah, part. For good reason, right? Because it's amazing. Yeah. And like, I think, you know, because I think a lot of people, especially in this day and age, got into JoJo maybe through the anime. Yeah. yeah. And then you talk to a JoJo manga fan and they're always like, yeah, Golden Wind was incredible. Part <laughs> four was incredible. And then the manga fan will turn around being like, yeah, but still more Rumba. Yeah, still more <laughs> that's, where, that's where shit gets real. Yeah. Because when I look at a manga list or ma- when I hear a manga fan, you're, I'm like, okay, there are a lot of casual anime fans. You know, there, yes. there's a lot that we see nowadays. I feel yeah. like manga readers, you, you, have, you have gone beyond the entry point of being a weeb, you know? You've, you've probably, yeah. Oh yeah, for sure. You know, yeah. you know, you you started. You've had to readjust how you read. Yeah, yeah. you literally read the opposite way now. Yeah, mm-hmm. because even, <laughs> even fucking shonen people who only read shonen stuff, there is there is like still a huge leap of being like, I want to catch up, so I am going to look at still pictures that don't have color in it. You know, yeah. <laughs> yeah, I mean, like to to, to in, a, in a sense, like reading Berserk and committing to reading that. It is kind of like you. It's because there's no very good anime adaptation except for maybe the original. Is that the first manga you read? No, 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 no. Okay, but like I. What was I, the first manga you read? Ah, uh, fuck! That's a great question. Uh, I actually don't know. You don't remember? No, I don't remember. I actually can't. I don't know which one I read first. Before I realized it was in my life. Because <laughs> the first manga I remember you talking about was Berserk. I can't no, 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 I definitely read JoJo before that. I definitely read. Some oh other yeah, stuff JoJo. Yeah, I definitely yeah, read some yeah, other yeah. stuff before that too. Yeah. Like I read. Uh, uh, I think Jojo- Eye Shield, I read before that. Oh, really? I read Eye Shield before Jojo, I think. Yeah. Um, Gantz, I think I read. Uh, I think I read after Jojo. But that, I, 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 I've, the, I think Berserk was that one time though, where I read this and I had this weird sensation of like, I am only gonna really get to experience it in this form. Yeah. Yes. Every other thing feels like there's always a, an alternative way to consume it. Mm, yeah. It's gonna be an anime. You know this, or there will be an anime. Or, <laughs> yeah. Berserk, and maybe there will be a, a Berserk adaptation down the line, but Berserk had this That's weird feeling. It's, it's unadaptable. <laughs> right. It is unadaptable. Yeah, it's the same about everything gone until they make a good adaption. Uh, uh, One Piece, unadaptable, and then they adapted it. One Piece is not unadaptable. Dude, unadaptable until they adapted it. Yeah, the, the adapted, uh, I, I would say- You can, uh, you can adapt <laughs> Berserk. I, I think the, the challenge is precisely what makes the adaptation so worth it. It's because everyone says it's unadaptable and because it's so hard to do it, that when it is done well, it's gonna be insanely magic. Okay, let me let me rephrase. Unadaptable with the current industry standards because yeah. uh, because but you'd, the, I mean, you'd, like, need I, inf- you'd need like infinite budget to do a good adaptation of Berserk. No, I don't think so. I, I think the think closest so. they got was the 90s adaptation, but that's that was because great. it was in the 90s where they were a little bit more open to being experimental and taking yeah. their time with stuff. But but, but like, I, I think that- The animation yeah. is shit. It is, but you know, compared to 2016, Does 2017- Does Berserk need to have godlike animation? 
Um, I think it, you'd be doing a disservice. Yeah, it, but you it, could say it, about it, every, every show. Yeah, yeah, it doesn't, yeah. but in order, like you you said like good adaptation, right? Yeah. Berserk has an amazing story and the fact that with a lot of like the more, okay, I said shit animation. I meant, I if 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 you wanna, if, if I wanna get- well, we all know what know, happened in 2017. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Right? yeah. 2016, 2016, 2017. 2016, yeah. yeah. I, I don't mean like shit animation. I mean like limited animation. Mm. Okay. That's, that's that's war of what I've meant. Sure. But so in terms you, of yeah, like- you better backpedal. Yeah, yeah, yeah. You better backpedal <laughs> that fucking <laughs> statement. <laughs> Cause I know people are gonna get- I get love up that, I love that anime. Yeah, but uh, it's, it's more like, it's very limited animation compared to a lot of other shows that aired in its time, but mm. they got the tone down, they got the story mm. down, they got the vibe down, which I think is the best adaptation of Berserk I've seen so far. Is also, it- best anime opening of the 90s, let's just say that yeah. as yes. well, with Berserk, like oh. the <laughs> actual yeah. best. Yeah, to, to like to preface, I do actually love the Berserk, uh, the original Berserk anime, yeah, but to say hell. that it is like, comparable to some of the fucking amazing panels mm. and art that is found in the I, manga. I mean, how do you put that to-, to But that's why that's, it's kind that's, of unadaptable. That's, that's what no, we're but I, talking no, but about. It'll, it'll get done, it'll get done, <laughs> it'll get done. <laughs> like you, you asked, well, how do you transfer these amazing- uh, Yeah, but it's, I, like, I think that it's never gonna look how you expect it to look and then that's okay. That's part of an adaptation. And I think yes. that just cause it doesn't look the way it did in the manga doesn't mean it's a bad adaptation. It could, be, it could even, uh, you know, enhance other aspects of the story that maybe couldn't have been serviced as well in the manga. It's, you know, there's always- Oh, sure. But I yeah, think as, uh, but I think in the, in the sense, like, you know, as Gaunt was saying, like, I think in this current day and age, like the, the industry standard, it's pretty goddamn difficult to do that. Yeah. Um, oh, I would say, I I would say near done. impossible to do that with the current standards, unless they change the standards. Uh, to fit that mold, then I don't think we'll be seeing a half decent or even good adaptation anytime soon. Yeah. yeah. And honestly, I, at this point, I don't think Berserk fans are like looking for it. No, I, th- I, th- I think Berserk fans have made peace with it. Um, yeah, I think they'd need like a, uh, if, if Guts had like a cute marketable plush mascot, then maybe we, we would have got an anime by now <laughs> um, because they would have sold enough to well, no, keep he has, funding the uh, show. What's, what's that? What's yeah, that? how long into the show gone? It's not season one material. We can't get no, those. We can't get wait. those plushies moving. Who are you talking about? Uh, the the the, fairy. Fairy. the fairy. The puck. Yeah, puck. That's yeah. not a marketable plush. I'm talking like I get a puck plushie. Yeah. yeah, yeah, I know you. You, you know, you know when he goes like chibi mode. Yeah, and it's just like that'd be like, so cute. Yeah. Oh yeah. yeah, I want that. Make yeah. that. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, you know, we we we've seen uh, you know how they make shows in Japan, and uh, if a show makes a lot of moolah, it gets many uh, seasons and many supports. <laughs> But I think Berserk's hard to sell like merch for. Yeah, do you know what I would want to see? Do you know? Do you know what I think would actually be fucking dope? What? Uh, instead of like a Berserk anime adaptation, just like a Dark Souls s game set in the actual Berserk world, I think that would That'd be cool. That'd that would be, that cool. be fucking sick. You know, you can use instead of like just trying to make a game where you follow Guts' story, just make a game that takes place in the insane fucking world of Berserk. Uh, <laughs> actually. Nah. Nah. No, no, nah. no. Why not? Nah. I feel like it wouldn't be like it's Berserk is the story, not the world. I don't know, man. I, don't know. The world, oh. I feel that the world, especially you know, once you get past the golden, uh, the, the, the golden, golden, age, the golden arc. age, yeah, yeah, that's like a golden like age is just like Game yeah, whatever. But after the golden age arc, the the world building gets pretty insane. Yeah. And some of the monster designs as like well. The, like, yeah, like the fairy forest and stuff yeah. like yeah, that. I mean, it could be cool, but I just, pretty cool. I just worried that it would have to be shackled to the show and the story beats to have any kind of yeah. like weight to it. Maybe. I don't know. I don't know. There might be room. For, there might be yeah. some wiggle room though, considering that again, like- I think if anything, it would have to be like a spiritual story, kind of- yeah, but then I guess that's that already exists. You're getting Elden Ring. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> that's, yeah, that's every <laughs> Souls game. That's the problem I'm having right now is that like, <laughs> would Elden Ring be better if it just had berserk monster designs, and I don't think it. What would. about just like a berserk DLC? I'd be tight. That'd be tight. Just, I feel like <laughs> maybe just, not even a whole game, just a DLC. Yeah. Yeah, I don't know. <laughs> Point being, berserk is so goddamn good. It's number one, and we're still trying to talk about how it's the go to number one, yeah. and how you can have more stuff. Yeah, I mean, yeah. This is. I don't see anything really taking over it. Oh. Um, it's it's the goat for a reason. And And it's the manga that's gotten a lot of people into manga as well.